I twenty eighth April, doing the daily duo trick order today. Uh, I'm going to jump straight into it and see if we can do it quite quick. We're going to start off with build nymph frock and waist. Hopefully, that will give us quite a few letters. Right, so first one is stare. Second one is stole. Uh, we got R O T. That could be a few things. Uh, that's going to be that's going to be either using or suing. Right, we had it right. I'll have to come back to that one after. Uh, so what we got here? We got an F. All right, that's going to be flesh. We've got uh, a T A I R an O ratio. Uh, I think that's going to be brook. Can't be frock because the C is there. Try brook. Uh, oh, and that B can be new so over there. Uh, B A U O Y B U. You, it's a bit of a, an American one. Don't know if see something like that on the English version. Uh, C O N E. Oh, it could be a few things. U uh, N C T and cut. G R I. All right, that spells up great. If you if you look across, you can see it spells great boat. Uh, M A S O N Mason and scroll down a little bit more. We got G R E A T, great B L I S. That's gonna be bliss, isn't it? Uh, we got an O S K I kiosk. And we've got an M A F oh, Mafia. Uh, that's another American one. We've got an S and R and A. Or oh, is a C there, so it's crash. This is a C O O N S and an O. Starts with a C. And it's got a, it's got a D, uh, condo, uh, condo, right? We all got quite a few American sort of slang, uh, words in you. We got an S and a, uh, and a salon, which I guess is an English word, uh, as in an A salon, but, uh, still an American as well. We got an R, a D, a T, an E, and an A. Uh, tread. Right. Um, D, an N, a Y, an O. And it's ended in a Y. No, I didn't. Uh, y N oh, there's a W there as well. Downy, Downy is out. Oh, well, okay. Uh, G O O ends in a Y and there's an F, but there, look. So it's goofy. F A Y C N, so it's fancy. And C R E oh, crept. I, I'm guessing you can see these, but there's a C, an R, an E, a P, and a T uh, going across. Uh, we've done 22 of 32. So we're halfway there. S, a U, an I, N, S, spunk. That's kind of an American one as well. So, 
different kind of meaning in that in English. M O T N and U mount. Uh, L E R ends in an R. L E and R. No, E has to be in the sec. But E can be in the second and the fourth place, and the L kind of suggests this lever. Yes. S T O uh, that spells out stout. If you look across there, you can see the S T O, the U, and the T. Uh, right. D and I and M and D. Denim. A T. It starts with T. Oh, it's got to be thick. Uh, because of that H up there. B L U R. It's not to be L. Uh, is blue spelled with double R? No. Uh, blurb. That's kind of an American one as well, isn't it? Uh, right, you've got a M U D Y, so that's going to be muddy. Now we're going back up, uh, we've got two left. Right, is this one which has now got a C and O, a C O. Uh, an N and an E. I want a V, Kevin. And we've got one more, which is uh, one of the first ones, uh, which has got an R O T E. Is T something R? O T Volta. The V came in there, Andy at the end. And there we go. Uh, that's taken seven minutes to do 32 word laws. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, it should be. Oops. That way. That and then. Just down to there. Uh, a subscribe button. And if you could also like as well, that'd be fantastic. Thank you very much. Goodbye.